Whitmer taking the trip down I-75. Track matchup with Finley. Max Roth had himself a night with one of his highlights, the dunk there. Let's move to the third quarter low scoring game. Roth adding to it a step back triple. That puts Finley ahead by four. But end of the third, Panthers, the inbounds pass to Cam Evans. Man in his face hits the three as Whitmer up or down just two. And in the fourth quarter, Whitmer with all that momentum. Tony Fisher down low, strong post move and scores. Whitmer leading by four. Derek James sealing it for the Panthers. And one as Whitmer bounces back from the tough loss at Perrysburg with the 68-61 win in the Flag City. I thought we just had to clean up a few things, you know, from the first half. We got beat on a couple back doors and we got beat on a couple plays where they were setting ball screens and, and uh, beat us away from the screen. And we had talked about that for two days and uh, we did a really good job of cleaning that up in the second half. But anytime you can come here on the road and get a win against Finley, who's always very, very well coached and, you know, they always play well at home. Just I'm so proud of our guys. Well, let's turn to Jason Griffin and Maddie Klein to break down the Whitmer victory. At Finley High School tonight, a track matchup between two rivals, Whitmer and Finley, and it was the Whitmer Panthers, Maddie Klein, after trailing for about the first, oh, 20 minutes of the game, came back and wanted a big win on the road. It's a huge win for them to be able to hang in, really come out in that second half, step it up, and then hold on tight. Everybody got involved. Awesome win for the Panthers. It was really impressive to see young freshman Antoine West. We just talked to Coach Stacy, and 14 years old, and to come on the road, hit those big free throws down the stretch and just an ultimate player. Very unselfish too. He does a great job making the extra pass, had some huge buckets and the one thing I like about this kid is he's out there leading already as only a freshman. He's telling other players what to do. He's the first one giving a high five or picking someone up off the ground and that's the type of player you want to see as a freshman out there leading your team. So Finley falls to one and three on the season for Whitmer. They're now three and two with a nice win on the road at Finley 68 to 61.